It's a pleasure and an honor to welcome all of you all today to uh, the launch of EcoCar 3. The EcoCar 3 competition will take things to a next level, to new elements of design, and allow the students to explore additional innovations beyond what have even been done in the past competitions. So we're thrilled with this great slate of competitors who have been chosen to take this on and with the great vehicle they will be working with. We revealed that the vehicle for the EcoCar 3 competition is the Chevrolet Camaro, which is going to be really exciting for the teams to work on so that they can develop skills and innovation in automotive systems while balancing the cost, which is a real challenge for the future of advanced technologies in automotive engineering. Since the Department of Energy launched our first Advanced Vehicle Technology student competition back in 1988, we've had more than 16,000 students participate uh, and through their participation receive invaluable real-world hands-on experience. We are extremely grateful for the support of our EcoCar 3 sponsors. Please join me in thanking you. Let me uh, turn now to the um, fun part. Uh, and uh, talk about the schools that are going to be competing over these next years. Uh, real, really a privilege, I think, of having this kind of, of team competition to uh, push the edge. There may be only one first prize winner, but it sounds like just about everybody wins in terms of their career, so this is the kind of outcome we want. It feels awesome to be chosen. We're brand new to the EcoCar family, and so we're really excited to be a part of it. EcoCar 3 is exciting because it allows us to develop our own vehicle and put our own innovation into the vehicle, something that we couldn't do any other way. It gives the opportunity for the not only the students, but the faculty actually to compete with other schools and to promote their automotive education and the programs and bring it to the next level and give the students the uh, opportunity to work with uh, latest technologies and up-to-date tools that's being used currently in the industries. 